I'll be uh, doing a walkthrough for the uh, Billie Jean's Legacy Bundle email campaign. Uh, walkthrough of the email campaign sequence in Infusionsoft. So, uh, dito, uh, after logging in at Infusionsoft, here's the homepage and you'll just go here, uh, click the burger icon here, then go to marketing, sorry, marketing and then campaign builder. Then magpupunta tayo sa page kung saan natin ginagawa yung mga campaign, uh, campaigns natin. Then we'll just go to Billy Jean's Legacy Bundle campaign here na uh, ginawa ko. Okay. So, ito yung uh, canvas niya. So, Itong mga elements dito sa loob is uh, ginawa ko through using the tools here on the left side. So uh, there are different types of tools. Uh, there are notes for this one, for the notes here, and this one. So you can just drag it here, there, so and type. Type the contents. And there are also tags like these two here. Uh, ayun, ito naman yung tag, which is tag applied. You can just drag it here from the left. I don't want to drag. Yeah. Then this one is a sequence. Uh, yun laman ng mga, ang laman nito yung mga emails, mga delay timers. So pag ganyan, pwede mo na lang siya i-connect with the green arrow here. It should be green so that it will be connected. So Yan yung method na ginawa ko to create this one, the sequence. So I'll just uh, delete this ones. Okay. So for the <clears throat> for this one, uh, I'll start with the tags. So yung tags is uh, for uh, it's like a mechanism to mark. Uh, let's say this one is for the existing email list of Billy Jean. So, yung current configuration nito ay, so, ang tag nito is BG existing list, legacy bundle launch, and it's categorized under funnels and automation ahead. Yan yung existing email list ni Billy Jean, yan yung representation niya. Then, yung other tag at this uh, right side is yung pa mga customers na <coughs> yung andun sa email list na nag-purchase ng Billy Jean na product. <coughs> Excuse me. So, ang current configuration niya ay ang tag niya ay purchase legacy bundle launch. So, under din siya sa category ng funnels and automation na added. Okay. Then, sa loob ng sequence, which is ito yung sequence ng emails na isi-send dun sa existing list ni Billie Jean, existing email list. So, I'll just double-click it here. Then, yan yung laman niya. So, Ang elements sa loob ay ito, by default, ito yung magsisimula yung start. Sa simula, ito lang yung laman nitong canvas. Then next is, nilagyan ko siya ng alternating sequence ng delay timer, which is ito. Here on the left. And email na tools. Ayan. Ito. So, I put seven of them alternating. to one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and connecting them in one sequence. So, uh, starting at the first delay timer, uh, I sinet ko lang muna siya as ano, as no delay, and any day, any time. Pero as uh, Coach Junior said. 
this will depend on the size of the email list of let's say for Billie Jean kung mas marami so mas maganda medyo i-spread mo into days so sinet ko lang muna as no delay here dito the next is yung first email niya then pasokin natin to eh. then ayun mula dun sa membership page ng Funnel University uh, nilagay ko yung su subject line here tapos yung para sa body ng email is nagdrag lang ako ng mga blocks ito on the left side and so this is image then the drag mo lang siya papunta dito then you'll just upload an image na ginamit ni Billie Jean sa marketing pages niya then for this one for this body this uh on below you just drag here text so i'll just copy the text from the membership page uh dun sa ano dun sa cartra page and i think text for email one <clears throat> uh taking note of the uh of the formatting of the text so i'll just run it down and then the hyperlinks na kailangan so i'll just show you the hyperlink configuration of this so here uh, it's it goes to getallmycourses.com and it's the same is applied the same hyperlink is applied on the other ones like here like this one and the on the bottom one this one <coughs> so uh, sa mga ibang emails pala nakita ko rin na let's say dito meron dito yung name ni Julius sa mga ibang emails so tinanggal ko lang yun since uh, kailangan generic muna yung, ano, yung content so next is <coughs> so yung email 2 yung next dito kailangan one day siya so, kailangan isend siya one day after ng email 1 so ang nilagay kong delay dito is one day and then run on any day and any time And let's look at email 2, which has almost the same content, uh, except the subject line. So this is the subject line. Then for the body of the email, I'll just run it down. And there with all the uh, hyperlinks also. So, okay. And we'll go to the next email 3 which should be sent two days after email one, which there are, uh, I just added a delay timer of one day after email two. Then email three, which I think has the same content with email two, so just a different email subject. So this is the subject and I'll just run through down the email body with all the hyperlinks as well okay let's let's return here and email 4 is sent one day after email 3 so i'll just put here one day any day and any time then for email 4 i'll just show you the content So here's the subject line and here's the body of the email. I'll just I just put here a image for the uh, for this part <clears throat> and still with the hyperlinks as well with to uh, redirecting to the same website. Okay, uh, let's go back and email five is sent one day after email four. So I'll just put uh, one day here and any day, anytime. Contents of email five. So here's the subject line and I'll run through the content with the hyperlinks. 
and I'll go to email six, which is sent one day after email five. So here it, here it is one day, any day, any time. Then the content of the e email six. Uh, here's the subject line, and I'll just run down through the content with the hyperlinks, hyperlinks as well. Okay, so let's go back there. And then for email seven, this email seven should be sent eight hours after email six. So that's why in this last uh, time delay here, I just put uh, eight hours delay and run on any day and send on any time. Here's the last email, the sequence. Then here's a uh, here's the subject line, and here's the content with the hyperlinks also. So okay, so that's about it for the email sequence for the legacy bundle. Thank you.